Installing a low-profile bracket on a GPU is a relatively straightforward but essential hardware modification that can significantly impact your computer's versatility. This guide will provide you with a detailed walkthrough of the process, ensuring you have the knowledge and confidence to adapt your graphics card for use in small form factor PC cases or slimline enclosures. Working with hardware components, especially those involving electrical connections, should always be done with caution. The first step in this hardware modification is to remove the GPU from your computer. If your system already has a GPU installed, it is essential to carefully extract it from the PCIe slot. Now that you have the GPU in your hand, the next phase involves removing the full-size bracket. Most graphics cards come equipped with a standard full-size bracket, designed for compatibility with conventional PC cases. To remove this bracket, you'll need to locate and remove the screw securing it in place. Typically, you'll find two or more screws holding the bracket to the GPU. Using a screwdriver, carefully remove these screws to detach the full-size bracket from the graphics card. With the full-size bracket successfully removed, you are now ready to attach the low-profile bracket. The low-profile bracket is specially designed for compact cases and has a shorter profile to fit within limited space constraints. Align the low-profile bracket with the holes on the GPU where you previously removed the full-size bracket. Attention to detail is crucial here. Ensure that the bracket's HDMI, DisplayPort, and other connectors align correctly with the GPU's corresponding ports. To secure the low-profile bracket in place, utilize the screws provided with the bracket itself. If these screws were not included, opt for any suitable screws that fit the holes in the bracket and the GPU. During this step, exercise caution not to over-tighten the screws, as excessive force could potentially damage the GPU or the bracket. With the low-profile bracket securely attached to the graphics card, it's time to reinsert the GPU back into the PCIe slot on your motherboard. Ensure that the graphics card is firmly and properly seated within the slot, and be sure to listen for the satisfying click of the PCIe latch as it locks the GPU securely in its position. Depending on the size and weight of your GPU, it's worth considering additional support measures to prevent sagging. Some high-end graphics cards come equipped with support brackets that attach to specific points on the computer case. These brackets help hold the graphics card in place, distributing its weight more evenly and reducing the risk of damage to the PCIe slot. After securing the GPU and bracket, the next step is to reconnect any power connectors to the graphics card. Ensure that all connections are snug, secure, and appropriately routed to avoid any potential obstructions or interference. Now that the hardware installation process is complete, you can proceed to power on your computer. Reconnect your computer to the power source and turn it on to verify that everything is functioning correctly. However, before you can fully utilize your GPU, you may need to install or update its drivers. This step is essential to ensure that your graphics card operates optimally and provides the best performance for your computing needs. In conclusion, installing a low-profile bracket on a GPU is a manageable and impactful hardware modification that allows you to adapt your graphics card for use in compact computer cases. By following these steps with careful attention to detail, you can achieve a space-efficient setup while maintaining the performance and functionality of your GPU. Always exercise caution when working with hardware components, and enjoy the benefits of your modified graphics card in your small form factor PC. This simple yet effective modification can significantly expand your computer's versatility and functionality, making it well worth the effort. Tell me in the comments what small form factor PC do you use? And what GPU do you want to install?
If you found value in my video please leave a like. Subscribe for other videos like this.